before the video starts, I just want to say I will be leaving links to other people's evidence um, in the description below. So yeah. Hi. Um, so usually I don't make videos like this. But as you guys know, I'm an ambassador for this company, um, That Sounds Gay USA. Um, so I originally DM'd them, as you can see here, and I said if they were looking for ambassadors, and, um, the conversation about that kept going. Here are some of the screenshots of the messages that they sent me. Um, yeah, I forgot to include them, but, um, here they are. I did find it quite weird, though. Also, ignore me, like, sniffling. I'm kind of sick right now. But, um, I found it kind of weird that they told me to buy something from their website and they wouldn't send me it for, like, free or even just for, like, a little amount, which is normally what you get from a company if you're an ambassador. Because my sister is a real ambassador and she gets free stuff from them all the time. So I thought, oh, they're gonna probably give me it for free. Um, and then they changed their company name to something else, like Pride Pack USA or something like that. And I was confused. And I was also confused because they don't even follow me on Instagram. I had unfollowed them, which is why it says in the DM, you don't follow each other on Instagram because I unfollowed them, but they never followed me. And I thought that was kind of weird. Um, so all of my past videos, you, you guys can just ignore the whole thing about that because I got scammed and I'm honestly really upset about it but I genuinely thought it was legit because a lot of my friends that I know followed the account had a lot of followers it was verified I was like okay this is legit it was not my code did work but there was no point <laughs> just a lot of bad stuff about like how like how the company reached out to these people first about being an investor and i'm 16 i don't know anything about like oh company invest like i don't know anything about this shit but what i do know is that what they pulled is not okay and a bunch of other people have been through this it isn't just me and as you can see here someone else has also been through this you can just look up that sounds gay USA. Just you don't even have to look up. You don't even have to type scam in or anything. Just type in that sounds gay USA. All the scams will pop right up. And when I saw this, I was like, "What?" I am not he here to like cancel a whole company, or maybe I am actually. Cause no, what they did is like so bad and it wasn't just me it wasn't just me that they did it to they've done it to like a bunch of other people and it's absolutely insane that they're getting away with this and i like how is this not getting media coverage like how is this not like bigger like i didn't even know about it and i was a ambassador no one's talking about it like why aren't people talking about this because it's there it's a scam like they're literally scamming people and yeah i'll admit when i accepted to be an ambassador i didn't really accept it i just was curious about it and she just told me she was like oh i already made you a code and i was like Hold up. <laughs> I I wanted to know more. 
before we talked about the code. But then I'm 16. I don't know anything about like ambassador or whatever. But what? <laughs> this whole thing is like crazy to me. I'm sorry if I look like trash right now. It's because as soon as I found out about this, I hopped right on. I hopped right on. I was like, I need to make a YouTube video about this because these people, this company is not like, okay. Like, it's just not. People who like weren't ever ambassadors, I've even heard that like, it takes like months for them to get a t-shirt that's not even that ends up not even being good quality and honestly i wasn't surprised when i was looking for their instagram photos when i found out that i was an ambassador for them um i was like okay yeah these shirts suck but i wasn't gonna say anything because it was a big deal to me i thought i thought like I was, like, I thought I was, like, like, famous. Not, like, famous, but I thought that, like, I was a real ambassador. Spoiler alert, if I wasn't, this is what this whole video is about. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Like, why are they like this? Oh, my God. But literally, like, sorry if you can hear, like, snoring. My dog is snoring in the background. But like, I don't, what I don't understand is why they're scamming people. And yes, I did contact them first, but like before I became, excuse me, before I became like an ambassador, I wanted to talk more about it. I wanted to get more information about it before I actually, before I actually did it. Cause it's a big deal. Um, but she, she just went right into it. She was like, okay, I made the code for you. Didn't even ask me what I wanted the code to be. Didn't even ask me anything. Didn't even ask for my permission. Didn't even ask if it was okay to even use a code in the first place. She just did it. And I was like, what? like what and i had to buy a shirt and she would leave me a special surprise in the package and me i think i was 15 at the time i'm 16 now this was like a year ago but i didn't i didn't have a job i didn't have money i couldn't pay for that shirt so i didn't get it ever she was just like let me know like she said something about the shipping number or something like that and I was like that's kind of sketchy but I didn't really think anything of it because I was like oh they're verified I don't think they're verified anymore I could be wrong but it's I'm like people need to be talking more about this because they have such a big following and there's other people who they're going to reach out to to ask them to be an ambassador and they're going to get scammed. And it's probably going to end up being worse than my situation. They could get their credit card information stolen. Like literally anything bad could happen. I'm glad that my situation wasn't bad, but... I don't know, just, like, I'm fucking 16. This should not be happening to me. <laughs> like, I even bragged about it to my family. I was like, I'm a brand ambassador, like, all that. And I honestly forgot about them for, like, the longest fucking time because they never talked about me. Like, they never said anything about me. They never talked to me ever they know like just nothing like nothing came up ever and 
people need to be talking about this because why why isn't this on like drama channels like why aren't people talking about this like this is a serious thing that is actually happening to not only me but a bunch of other people to the point where if you just look up the company's name a bunch of scams will pop up so that's really all i have to say um it's like 10 o'clock at night and i'm tired and i have school tomorrow but um i just need to get that off my chest because what the fuck and i will be taking the link out of all my descriptions in all of my videos um because the link doesn't even exist anymore i don't think because they changed their whole company so yeah um they're fucking scammers and that's all i have to say